do we use energy at home? We all know Americans are energy hogs, consuming more than twice as much total energy as our friends over in the UK. One reason is that we drive big cars long distances here. But the other is that we use a lot of energy at home for heating, cooling, and lighting, as well as accessing electricity to power our dishwashers, TVs, and computers. Despite an increasing population, larger average homes, and the proliferation of gadgets, our residential energy consumption has only gone up from about 9.5 quadrillion BTU in 1980 to a little over 10 quadrillion BTU in 2009. Let's look at how this happened. Back in 1980, a full 56% of household energy consumption went to space heating. By 2009, that number had fallen to just 42% of the mix and had dropped in real terms as well. Now, new heaters are more efficient, but most of the change occurred for demographic reasons. Basically, people moved to warmer places. Because more people live in the Sun Belt, we use a little more air conditioning than we used to, but not enough to offset the fall in heating. The other really big change over the last 30 years is the increased energy used by our appliances and lighting. They now take up 35% of the mix. Mind you, it's not just computers and phones. More and more homes have microwaves, dishwashers, electric dryers, two or more televisions, and yes, gadgets. 